Mama Me Scrapping, and I am here with my new kit from the Secret Not Secret Kit Club by Christina Sorge and Redefined Creative. And I have only ripped it open and folded it back. That's it. So I do not know what's in there. So this is my January 2019 kit. Oh, it is packed tight in there. Oh, look. This is supposed to be to prevent the mail lady from folding it in half. Do you see how crimped it is? It was in my mailbox like this. Yeah. I don't know what I did to tick off my mail lady, but she doesn't like me. I also don't know why I'm not just ripping this paper open since I, you know. Christina, there's glitter. I'm sorry about that my husband called and um he was offering to pick up dinner so i kind of wanted to take that phone call because i'm hungry um so christina always puts in a little note and now mine are addressed to tag girl since she loves to call me that oh i love how she just puts in a little note she is so sweet so this kit is for my at the secret not secret kit club does anybody else take the washi that christina uses and saves it somewhere it's like literally just out of frame right there like i'm here i'm touching it anyways i have to save it so all right so you'll hear more details about my challenge when the party starts. So those are my embellishments. Oh, I like those. All right. So it looks like a lot of this is from A New Day by Dear Lizzie, which was her previous new new uh, collection. But now Creativation is this weekend. And so something else new and fabulous is coming out. Um, I like these puppy stickers. I am going to struggle using the giraffe with the glasses. The llama with the glasses, no problem, because I still have pictures at, of Christmas of my daughter and my sister and their llamas together. I don't think I've done this year's photos. And if I have, that's not a problem. I have more photos. But I quite like a lot of those. So I set those aside. I like these stickers. They're not falling apart in the package, so that's already a plus. Let's look at the paper. I like that. I like that. I really like that branding strip. I need to get some of that. This is New Day Come Alive. And this will be nice because my um, How to Kill a Kit kit is kind of, um, has two sheets of paper left that are full sheets. This is from Whimsical. Now I do have the entire Whimsical collection. However, there are certain sheets. This is one of them that I wanted to get another one of because I like both sides so much. This side I think would be very fun to, to use. I got a piece of red cardstock. Now I have not used solid colored cardstock in a while. So I have some ideas of what I can do with that already. More Whimsical. And I think I've used this one. I love it. The blue with the pale cream polka dots. I just used this paper on another layout that I actually just filmed just prior to this one. And I got ink right here from my spongy, what's it called? Inking. What is this? This thing. I got it on my table. Oops. I want to wipe off, right? So I just used this and I love this paper. I love this side. I love this side. I used both sides on the layout I just did so I am happy to have some more of this because I used my last sheet up like 15 minutes ago. Heidi Swap. I do not have any Heidi Swap paper so this is Hawthorne and it's a beautiful textured color. Woo! Okay this makes my eyes dance but I like it. Like dance in a good way. Um, so make your eyes dance on the screen. If you look you can see that the dots are different colors. It's kind of like textured like this in the dots so that's fun oh she put in some stargazer okay y'all stargazer i do not know how i miss this collection but it is amazing and i have used almost i think i used a lot of this side this is a road trip side 
um, love to go on road trips, be free, count the stars, find true love. A lot of those sentiments are not necessarily ones I'd use to scrapbook, but the color is great. I love the ombre. Kind of got this dark going into light, and it's not like a straight um, ombre. It kind of curves like this, which I think is interesting. Oh, I don't have any of this. Crepe paper is not a company I tend to look for. So I would not use this side, but I do like this side. And again, it's kind of one of those that makes my eyes be weird. I like it. Moda Scrap. Oh, that crepe paper one. I don't even know the name of it. What is it? Express. And then the Stargazer one was Be Free. And the Hawthorne one was Eden. Aren't you so happy I did this? Now, this is one-sided. Moda Scrap, Thinking About Rio de Janeiro. I don't have anything by them. This is my first piece. And I like this blue. It's quite nice. Ah! Y'all, I bought, like, the full Head in the Clouds kit from Christina. And she did not have this paper. She told me she would send it when she had it. And she sent it this month. Oh, my gosh. I just need a moment, y'all. This is beautiful. Beautiful rose gold stars. It's flocked. I just, I am in love. I'm, I'm, I need to get more of this. Christina, can this go on my next kit, too? All right, let's get embellishments. So I've got some... Hello Cute Badges Set by Studio 40. So some flair. It says they're all hashtag smile, cute, sweet, and play. All perfect for using with my daughter. And now comes the fun part of opening the embellishment bag and seeing what's in here. Look guys, it's a whole bunch of white stuff. Isn't that amazing? I love how I manage. Oh! Look at those. Look at those. Oh, those are so pretty. Oh, okay. Secret, not secret. Um, sequin mix by Spiegel Mon Scraps. These are gorgeous. Oh, I can't wait to use those. All right, so let's see what we have here. We've got some die cuts. I've got some hearts. Oh, some stuff from Whimsical. Oh, I like that love. And, of course, she had to send me a tag because she hates me. I don't like tags, if you haven't heard that yet. If you're new to my channel, I don't like tags. Tags, no. That's why she calls me Tag Girl, because they drive me insane. Oh, oh I like this. Dream, hello. Got some clouds. Got some other stars. These are not stars. I know shapes. These are hearts. So I've got some yellow. Oh, so pretty. So pretty. Okay, I gotta know if these have adhesive on the back. No, they don't. But they also don't have anything else on the back. So this is easy to put some foam dots in and probably two or three, depending on the thickness. But, oh, is this just not fabulous? Oh, I just cannot get over it. All right, hold on, we gotta open this. Let me get a little sequin tray. Let me get a sequin tray. Oh, look at all of those, y'all. She's got these blue ones. And then those, those, are those black? It would help if I could actually pick it up. I think those are black. Maybe dark, 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 dark navy or dark, 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 dark gray. We've got some iridescent ones. Where's my little jewel picker thingy? White. These I love. I love those. Ooh, we got some confetti in there. Now, is that two things? I think that's two things stuck together. Yes, it is. Okay. My sister told me that when they don't have dots in it, or little holes, they're not sequins or confetti. So we've got some of those iridescent ones and some pink ones. We've got white ones. Is there anything else in there? Oh, what's this one? We've got a really big one. Oh, y'all, this is beautiful. So this makes me really happy, too. I cannot wait to create with this kit, and I'm going to have to because our scrap party is not until next week. So, if you are not a member of the Secret Not Secret Kit Club, um, look up Redefine Creative online. You can go to the website, find Redefine Creative and Secret Not Secret Kit Club on Facebook. Message Christina. She makes awesome kits, and 
Ah, oh, beautiful, beautiful. And all of this was only $33 shipped. So, which I think is pretty good. And guys, I got, I finally got it. I got it. Oh, I'm so excited. I can't wait to use this. All right, y'all. I'm going to stop rambling. I hope everybody has a lovely day and I'll see y'all later. Bye.